after having played this game for a little while, I think my average mission time is actually just going up as I figure out how to get distracted by more and more things. <laughs> Moment we're supposed to be collecting alien eggs, but we have way too many side missions <laughs> that I keep getting distracted by. Should be an egg in there somewhere. Uh, no, apparently not. Up one of these tunnels. But there's gold over here. So we have to go and get this first. And then I heard a fester flee. So we have to deal with that. Or let Bosco deal with it. And now we're stuck in a sandstorm and I can't fucking see anything. Although I've developed a sixth sense for when these exploding bastards are trying to sneak up on me. <laughs> That's just Molly. There's our bug. Get a Bosco! <laughs> okay, good. Let's collect our last resupply and get that bloody egg. More gold. Molly, 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 come here. Molly, Molly, please. She's just getting confused and staying still. Pause it and get that egg, and then we're back to the space rig. Just have to figure out how to get into that tunnel. Hmm, no, it is this way. Hang on. Oh, that's a sneaky one. Is this a nice zero gravity mission, or low gravity mission? So if we're really high up a ceiling, then we can just use our grapple hook to catch us on the way down again. Let's not brace for that swarm. Let's just call our own drop pod. <gasps> Ooh, compressed gold. We have enough to fight, although we might not even need to. We'll just give this to Molly. Ooh, very nice. <gasps> the New Year's rabbit. Oh god, I have to carry this the whole way to the drop pod now. Although it's pretty close. Ooh. Oh, that was an advanced maneuver right there. <laughs> All those detonators did more damage to their friends than they did to us. Plus, if we're just jumping, then let's go and grab that. We'll take that. Yeah, he's following. I'm actually very not sure how to get to this drop pod. <laughs> I hope Bosco doesn't drop that. Ah, okay, it's just back in the starting cave. Here he comes. Yeah, Bosco, you can just put that down anywhere. Go oh, sandstorm. It <laughs> didn't go in. There we go. Okay. Okay, I'm getting out of here, if we can, because that sandstorm is very not helpful. <laughs> okay, I'm hoping that this is enough for us to finally be able to promote our scout, which will unlock half the features in this game, I think. Still not sure what the two different level systems are for. <laughs> no, we didn't get the promotion. <laughs> so close. Did get a pretty nice payout, because that's part of a story mission. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, we, we can keep that paint job. I think I want this. Because I end up firing into a swarm. And I want to try and shred as many of them as I can. Not really that good. Because I get caught out with not being reloaded lots of the time anyway. And then I'm putting back on Taming Steve. Because I miss him. <laughs> so this is a long and complex cave. Let's see what's on tap at the bar at the moment. Slayer Stow. <laughs> as well. Recharge power attack faster. Is always good. Get that down. Okay. This should be the final mission for our promotion and we're gonna try make it a quick one too not seeing a lot of resources here but this is one of those caves that's always hard to see anything in there's some nitro up there that's very early for an oppressor to spawn in he's not even paying that much attention to us oh i like those fire rounds actually had a nice little spicy kick uh, yeah and we can actually shred through a crowd now do i'm missing a leg yes we are okay, that power attack charge is very fast i'm gonna have to use that way more. Gotta collect some flowers here too. Bosco, do you mind clearing that for me? I really don't think there's a whole lot in this cave. It's all hiding in the next one. He tries to convince himself. Uh, that's a big hole. I just missed like an entire clip on that loot bug. Okay, let's start making our way down. Ooh, oh god, the meteors are tearing apart this cave. Nothing in that one. It's a decent amount of gold, two separate trunks. I do wonder what they use all these flowers for because they don't use them to brew any of the beers or anything. It's the second oppressor, which is a little bit more than usual. <laughs> yeah, got caught out on the reload there again. Got a leg somewhere over here. God, there's a lot of cropper in this cave. Always seems to be one of the most abundant things for me. Oh, Bosco, would you mind picking that up for me? All right, we can get a Steve. <laughs> Almost completely forgot. Oh, no. Shit. Oh, he did not last long. Bosco, you still got that leg? I think he does. Blue bugs are trying to escape. They're coordinating with the pot noodles. Uh, missing legs. Not quite sure where that first one landed. Under? Oh, could be... It's hidden in a little bush. Salvage these mules, find these flowers, crack open the rest of these rocks. Even though we've already found one play card and we rarely get more than one when it's multiple meteors. Do-do-do-do. Yeah, I think with these 
flaming shotgun shells. I should actually try using the cryo grenade as well. So yeah, you can snap freeze something with a cryo grenade and then just melt it with the shotgun shells. Oh, oh, that's not good. Need some of that red sugar. Okay, <laughs> almost lost our foamer there as well. Yeah, Bosco has freezing rocker. Hit him again, freeze him. Okay, maybe that combination doesn't work particularly well. Whoa, God, we're getting a lot of these guys today. Ooh, nope. And they used to be a lot scarier than they are now. Good, Steve. Seems like there's a lot more on this meteor. Plus way more of these stupid rock pox Praetorians. <laughs> At least Steve distracted him. <laughs> Having trouble finding these plants in a cave full of plants. Yeah, that's a super fast recharge on the pick power attack. <laughs> there's our lift out of here. Assuming we manage to get it working. <laughs> we can deposit here as well. Save Molly a trip. Loop bugs can live for the time being so they can harvest more minerals for us. all the flowers we're hiding down here. Uh, that's not a good spot for all those legs unless we were to strategically mine out the floor under... Oh god. Got a low flying goo bomber. We can just roll him over this way. <laughs> okay, they don't really roll. It just falls straight down. <laughs> Ah, like a brick. But our legs are much closer now. Good, Steve. Although they weren't particularly far to begin with, I would say. I was just feeling kind of lazy. Last one. It's a shame we never get to use mini mules. Don't think we can deposit in these right now, because it just runs away. It didn't give me the option there. And we need more flowers and to find that last meteor. The loot bugs are escaping. Oh, no, that's a big fall. This cave is such a mess, I can't tell where the last meteor is. That was the original. Still need to find that New Year's rabbit as well. There's our missing meteor. Do a quick foam up job. Get Bosco to fight the rock pox Praetorians while we do the vacuuming as soon as one appears because he gets distracted very easily. Looks like something is stirring down there. Yeah, keep applying the foam. Grab a vacuum. Give it the good suck. And we're done. Uh, is that two? Yes, it is. Or is it three? It's just a mess. Okay, we're nowhere near the quota on the flowers yet. And we need our lucky New Year's rabbit. It looks like there's a cave under this cave. And that just tunnels back to the drop pod. Maybe there's flowers in here though. Or maybe not. Uh, no, spoke too soon. Good for you. And even a few minerals. There we go. We have enough. Beer brewing ingredients would be appreciated, but we can make do with what we've got. Push that button of yours. These things have way too fast a turning circle. Let's ride Molly up. This is the sneaky way in that Deep Rock Galactic doesn't want you to know about. Or maybe this just doesn't work at all. Yeah, as soon as we're off, she goes, oh, they thought of everything. This is basically how I fix anything mechanical, electrical, and or emotional problems that I find myself having. It might have been a good idea to grab a resupply before we turn that on, but this is where we find ourselves. <sighs> We'll take a Steve. Good boy. He's amazing just to have for the distraction. And he's very useful in terms of helping to find the closest targets. Let's see where they drop these fuel cells. Usually they put them in the most inconvenient location possible. Like my money is the top of this cliff. What do you think, Steve? Oh, God damn. Mission Control just trying to make me look like an idiot. And it's working. No problem you can't solve just by hammering on it. This is a great example of technique. I always like to uh, just put my back in against the wall. Oh, sorry, Bosco. Oh, God, they're coming in behind us as well. Oh, Jesus. That is an oppressor. I'm being oppressed. I am close to the fuel cells. Okay, got him. Climb. Yeah, we don't have much space to work with here. Almost leave. This feels like it's taking a lot longer than normal. Oh, we have, like, no ammo. Resplite, 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 resplite. Come on. Okay, good. Uh, can't tame another Steve just yet. Just a couple more seconds. You know, sometimes I just wish they'd skip the radiation shielding. Get any loose bits of gold lying around? You know, waste not, want not, and we're gone. Quick slap on the dice. And that should be a promotion right there. <laughs> Now we got one more job left to do. We're like 100% absolutely infected already. <laughs> Looks like we got to do four missions for our promotion now. Oh, that's a bit of a kick in the tea. <laughs> I think we'll start that in the next one. Leave this video here for today. Thanks very much for watching.